Hi, this is Rian from Must Be Noob. This lab guide is on how to set up Google Federation for Microsoft Entra ID B2B guest users. By setting up Federation with Google, you can allow invited users to sign into your shared apps and resources with their own Gmail accounts without having to create Microsoft accounts. After you have added Google as one of your application's sign-in option, on the sign-in page, a user can simply enter the Gmail address as they use to sign in to Google. Google Federation is designed specifically for Gmail users. To federate with Google Workspace domains, use SML and WS Fed Identity Provider Federation. First, create a new project in the Google Developers Console to obtain a client ID and a client secret that you can later add to Microsoft Entra ID. Sign in to console.developers.google.com with your Google account. It is recommended that you use a shared team Google account. Accept the terms of service if you are prompted to do so. At the top of the page, select the project menu to open the select a project page. Choose new project. On the new project page, give the project a name, for example, my B2B taste app. Select create. Wait for a few seconds. Project is created successfully. And also, the newly created project is currently selected. In the left menu, under APIs and Services, select OAuth Consent Screen. Under User Type, select External and then select Create. Under App Information, enter an application name. Under User Support Email, select an email address. Scroll down and stop at Authorized Domains. Under Authorized Domains, select Add Domains and then add the MicrosoftOnline.com domain here. Under Developer Contact Information, enter an email address. Select Save and Continue. In the left menu, select Credentials. Select Create Credentials and then select OAuth Client ID. In the Application Type menu, select Web Application. Give the application a suitable name like Microsoft Entra B2B. Under Authorize Redirect URLs, add the URI. Type the URI as HTTPS login.microsoftonline.com. After adding the first URI, again click on Add URI. URI 2 and URI 3 are same. The only difference is here. I have specified tenant ID here. And in third URI, I have specified a domain name, which is mbnlab.onmicrosoft.com. So you have to make sure that you provide your correct tenant ID and tenant name. Once you define authorize redirect URIs, select create. Keep the current window open. Later, you need to copy your client ID and client secret. You will use them when you add the identity provider in the Microsoft Entra Admin Center. If you want, you can download the information in JSON file. Access Microsoft Entra Admin Center as an external identity provider administrator or a global administrator. Click on Go to Microsoft Entra ID. Keep in mind that Azure Active Directory is becoming Microsoft Entra ID. Under Identity, select External Identities. Select All Identity Providers and then select Google button. In the pop-out window, enter the client ID and secret you obtained earlier. First. Copy Client ID. Paste here. Then you need Client Secret. 
Let's copy it. And let's paste here. Once you copy paste the client ID and secret, click save. Now the Google Federation configuration is done. Confirm that Google is listed under configured identity providers. In this lab guide, you learn how to set up Google Federation for Microsoft Entra ID B2B guest users. That's all for this lab guide. Stay tuned for more videos like this. See you all in the next lab guide.